Hello, everybody. It's Chibi. I'm plugging in my mic. Give me just a second. Oh. There it is. Okay. Well, everybody, I'm doing this live stream here today to talk about a couple of events that's transpired in the past couple of days. Most likely you know by now. Let me get this uh, ready. Wait a minute. No, not working. That's weird. Speakers. There we go. Got it. Okay. Anyways, talking about the events that transpired, this morning I woke up and I found out my Chibi Otaku account was falsely flagged again. Not just Chibi Reviews, but this, my new channel I'm currently live streaming on was falsely flagged. Now, here's the thing I'm talking about right now. Supposedly, whatever happened, like, uh, YouTube thought it wasn't spam or whatever it was I got flagged for and they brought the video back up because it shows now. It shows that the video is back up. My account is back up. My account was suspended earlier this morning at 8 o'clock. I, I don't know who would go out of their way to flag my video again, my honest video when I said what happened to Chibi Reviews. Who would go out of their way to flag me again? You've already crushed my entire original channel. Who would do that? I just want to talk about these events because how could someone be so cruel to want to kill someone's channel I and mean, go for another channel again? It's not right. It's really not right. You know, I'm just wondering, like, why would someone want to go out of their way to ruin someone's life? I, I, I don't understand that. I don't. Because if the majority of people by now know that I did this for a living, I did. And now to see it gone, it just, yeah, just, I don't know what to do. I'm at, I'm at that point right now where I really don't know what to do, everybody. I'm being honest. I mean... I've tried my hardest to do what I can do. I mean, I've sent in the appeal form for my account. I've made this new account, Chibi Otaku. I got it this morning, honestly, uh, about three to four hours ago to make start working on videos, stuff I missed yesterday, and then it says my account was suspended. Thank God it was brought back. I just... I don't understand, you know, why. I mean, if this video gets flagged, who's cruel enough to do that? Seriously. Do you not realize that even if you think it's funny, you're, you're killing someone's livelihood, you're killing someone's happiness? I don't know who did it to my first video I uploaded on this uh, channel, but it's not right. Hopefully, I didn't offend you in any way. And if I did offend anyone in some way, I'm sorry. I don't know what I did. But if I did something to justify being flagged and fly for spam, I'm sorry. I honestly don't know what I did, but if I did do something, I just wanted to say that. I want to talk about a couple of things that uh, happened yesterday that it's not about bad news, it's actually just insanely good news. I had crazy amount of support from so many YouTubers. Not just YouTubers, but other people I've never spoken to. For instance, YouTubers that I never thought would have wanted to communicate or associate with me at all. For instance, I recently saw a video in the Chiba Community Facebook page, and it said that um, that Jorge actually made me a video talking about me and all that, and he felt bad. And then I saw uh, Sawyer, he made a video. Well, not, he didn't make a video, he made a comment on my recent video. For Never also talked to me. Code Provider said something. Yokorama said something. Everybody just pitching in and helping him, and there's so many videos that people are trying to support me. You know, that that's the only thing right now that's clearly making me look forward, look ahead, and try my hardest. Now, my honest 
plans at the moment, truthfully. I want to upload to this channel. I do. And if I don't, it'll feel like I've given up. It will. And if it wasn't for all of you, Chiba's currently posting. I'm seeing a bunch of it right now. I probably would have, like I said, given up. And I, I still feel so miserable what happened. I mean, I can't feel miserable all the time. So, uh, I plan on having a backup to this Chibi Otaku channel, for instance. I want to be uploading videos also to Daily Motion. If you know what that website is, you, yeah, it's not nearly as popular as YouTube. But clearly... YouTube doesn't protect people that need to be protected, people that have honest reviews, people that have, you know, good videos, something, you know, someone's just doing to have fun, and when they're not doing copyright things, like, for instance, my videos is just me doing this, talking, and so I'm going to be uploading videos to Chibi Otaku and to the Daily Motion Chibi Reviews account, because in case, for some reason, this account does go down. Let's say it goes down today, tomorrow, or in the future. Or let's say Chibi Reviews comes back in a week or a month. It's possible the stuff that happened to me could happen again and to any YouTuber. If it can happen to me with one video, it could happen to any YouTuber out there, not just me. It could happen to big channels, it seems. I mean, I was so close to 10,000, I feel... And fear for anyone that has this happen to them, because it can happen to anyone at any time. I mean, one minute you could be uploading a review or a video of something, and then an hour later you get told that that video is marked as spam. And so, hopefully that never happens to any of you, honestly. I mean, for some reason, if my channels get closed down and I'm ruined completely, I hope, I pray, I hope, it never happens to any of you. I do. I do. I don't wish what I feel on anyone. But I also feel happy knowing how many people really support me. So, I p actually wanted to do something special with this. You know, I'm going to be trying to do a lot of reaction, actually. I'm going to see if I can do a lot of reaction to a couple of anime shows I missed yesterday. And so, give me just a moment to find them. Because, I mean, I haven't watched any anime since, you know, Saturday night, and it's Monday now, and I just, I'm so out of it, I haven't felt like watching anime, but I mean, I need to get back on my feet. So, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to see if I can get this uh, anime episode, and then I'm going to watch it, have a lot of reaction, I guess, to some certain shows, just to break the monotony. And, you know, give you guys some content you probably want to see. You probably don't want to see me all depressed, so... I mean, it would be a lot better if I did that. But... I just want to tell you, though, everybody, currently out with the comments I'm seeing, the amount of support you're all giving... is insane. I mean, I read them all right now, everybody. Just, you know... Saying, you know, you can do it. You know... Don't feel bad. All sorts of different comments I'm seeing through here. I just want you all to know every single one you send me truly matters. It does. So, as this downloads, I guess I'm going to be talking. I have three minutes until this downloads, so as that does that, I guess I'll just be talking. But um, I want to do a couple things and talk about some stuff. All the YouTubers that currently commented, supported me, and did things I never thought was possible. I really don't know how I could repay all of you. I don't. I don't know how I could repay Sawyer, Jorge, Forever, Panda, yeah, you know, Code Provider, all sorts of reviewers, Sage, Dan, Bonkai, so many, Rick, there's so many reviewers, so many YouTubers, not just you fellow achievements, but so many reviewers I never really talked to on a face-to-face -face basis that are actually supporting me with this issue I'm currently having. And so to know how our community actually can be united when it matters, that means a lot. I mean, I've seen a lot of drama, honestly, in this. I mean, I've seen a lot of drama on anime community for the past six months. I've seen a lot of it. 
but to know that how a bunch of reviewers that technically despise each other or dislike each other could come together and actually try to help out it makes me happy. I mean, I, I just I want you all to know if I could ever repay you, I will. I will do it instantly. I, I would. I really do. I hope this entire issue gets solved. I hope my uh, channel does come back because it's sad, really, because I mean, every day I would wake up every morning and, you know, look at the comments and stuff. So I just want you to know I haven't lost hope. I haven't lost hope. It may seem it, but I haven't. I haven't lost hope. I'm going to stay focused. I want to upload stuff to Chibi Mage. And let's just hope the person that flagged even my What Happened to Chibi Reviews video, and that, thank God, thank God, it didn't get taken down. YouTube saw it was false, even though they didn't see my One Piece review was false. I don't know how. Supposedly with tags and thumbnails and shit when this is standard shit I do all the time and I that's not considered spam. I didn't send links to no one constantly spam them either, so it wouldn't be that, so it just hopefully it comes back, because it definitely was wrong what happened. It, it's injustice. And if it doesn't come back, it just shows you how flawed YouTube really is. It shows you how they do not care about their own community or anything. I mean, just yesterday, I saw a freaking a Twitter post. I had a Twitter post by the mod from the Google Forms, the actual mod, post on my Twitter and say, it doesn't matter what you do. YouTube and Google can ignore half a million angry fans. That's what I had post on my Twitter by a mod from the Google Forms. That's what was even said on my Twitter. You see what these people are like? They don't give a shit. But they ha they are rot. It is blunt honesty, I guess. YouTube can ignore half a million people because you got to think they probably have like 40 fucking million people on YouTube. They don't have to worry about half a million. It's saddening. It's, it's like that. But uh, my video is done. So... I want to watch it. It's a comic got kill if you didn't know. Let me get off all these links. Give me a second. Oh. Minimizing, minimizing, okay. And then I want to start this. I recommend starting it too if you guys haven't watched it. I'm starting episode 5 of a comic got kill. Uh, today I'm just going to be i trying to live stream a couple of shows I missed, and you guys get my reactions. Hopefully it gets my mind off of it. So, I'm starting now, so the video will start in any second now when it decides to go up. Uh, go up. There we go, wait. Okay, I can hear it. And make this full. What the hell is taught to me doing? So he's remembering his friends from the past, huh? So this clearly shows he hasn't given up on his friends. Like, he hasn't forgotten them completely. Still hurts him. Now, I heard supposedly from a lot of people is that this uh, episode uh, is very good. It has, like, a character... Shoot, Justice, I think that's the name I heard. A bunch of people are talking about that, so hopefully... Oh my god. New sounds like new new. <laughs> oh shit. I like this glasses chick. She's cute. She's a lot different than I thought. Like, she's... She seems really ditzy. Yay! Opening song! Oh, I love this song. Okay, I want to check comments as this plays. Dun, dun. Woo! Oh, 
Okay. Can't wait for just. Uh, okay, I'm reading the comments. Can't wait for justice in East Death. I think that's it. Kanahana, why you voice best slash worst girl? Let's see. The episode was okay. Hmm. Let the new cheer you. Uh, let's see. Did you see this, some great news? Attack on Titan officially in pre-production for season two. Yeah, I saw that on the Chiba Community Facebook page. That's a, that's amazing news. That's that's really amazing. I'm, I'm glad that's actually happening for Attack on Titan. Let's see. I love this fucking song. It's so good. Ah, I can't. What the fuck? There it is. Let's see. I already told you when the intro started dark. See, I don't know... Which minute? Okay. It's about to start in the opening right now. Let me get to it. I'm at three minutes and three seconds, if you didn't know. Arranged by Akame. Kill the dream. You know, some people have been complaining about the artwork. I don't see why, honestly. I really do like the art style. It kind of reminds me of uh, Captain Earth a little bit, the way the faces are drawn. Those facial reactions. <laughs> oh, God. You know, I will have to say, though, that, that freaking cooking outfit Akane has on is so adorable. Really adorable. Three guys, I mean, three girls against one. Yeah, that, that kind of sucks. Oh, damn, he's got some armor on. Oh my god, I bet that would suck ass trying to swim through water with that. Oh my god. How much did armor weigh like that? Did it weigh like 100 pounds? She's giving you that death stare. Or that. You burn meat. So she is ditzy. I was right from the first start of the episode. Wow. <laughs> oh my god, that's a lot of sugar. I'd be set for life with that amount of sugar. How do you accidentally wash mine with the laundry? So she's also very forgetful instead of just ditzy. That reminds me of Welma. Anyone remember Welma from Scooby Doo? Like, my glasses, my glasses, I can't see you without my glasses. That's exactly what that reminds me of. Oh, backstory, okay. That's messed up, so she was bullied when she was a child. Saying that she was crazy. Dude, that was Opai, holy hell. <laughs> I want to say that girl is dead, I'm calling it right now. That girl is dead, that girl is definitely dead, because... She's remembering a flashback, she's an assassin. What caused her to become an assassin? I guess her friend died? I want to say that now. That girl's dead, the brown-haired girl. Oh, 
I, I might be right. Oh my god, I was right. I fucking called it. I called it. I called that shit. Oh. Dude, the fuck. Oh, guy. You see that guy? Oh. Dude. That, that's fucking crazy. Looks like she's cutting butter. Okay, so she did die. Never mind. Oh, so our friend isn't dead? Oh, wait. No. Oh. Ah. Uh. I guess she might be a little bit crazy because, you know, her parents were just killed and she still was surprisingly calm. What the hell? That That's scary. I like the animation in that scene, though. It's not the best, but I like it. Oh my god! Oh, dude, look at that fucking color! Oh! Oh, god! Oh my god, look at the blood, man. It's fucking god, that was a fountain. Oh, that, that, dude, that looks fucking painful. Oh, look at that still frame, the way they have it moving. Or that CGI still frame. It's a pretty twisted backstory. Oh yay! Knuckle 2.0 oh my god, that's still frame on him. He's doing his pets. Oh my god, that's disturbing. That is disturbing. That is so disturbing. Oh my god. That is Knuckle 2.0, man. Uh, there, there's no other name for him. Wait, he's getting a Tegu? Wait, so he's getting that Tegu? Oh, doesn't that fill out a little bit fast? Or was it from, oh, well, it's from Zank, the Executioner, if I'm correct, from last episode, but that feels a little bit fast. Oh, well. Probably just my imagination. So he's going to be able to see people's, like, thoughts. That's going to be cool. Oh, my God, that fan service. <laughs> That's just good. Oh, my God. Mine looks great. I'm just going to be honest. Oh, my God. That's great. Oh, so he's not getting it. Never mind. That, that's fucked up. They just take it from him? Oh, so he's not going to be using the, uh, the peeper, Tegu? Like, you know, where he could peep at women's clothing? I wonder if that uh, the leader of Not Raid has one. Control's eyes. So the strongest Imperial arm, or Tega, whatever you want to call it, is at the Northern 
part of the capital. Go still for Ace, man. What the fuck? Okay, now I see why I saw a little bit of complaints on this episode. No still frames. They look good, but they're lazy. Oh, who the hell is that? Blue haired. Imperial arm that can resurrect people. No, 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 no. There you go. Knuckle two point out. Set him straight. Wow. So from this development, we see he clearly still is mourning the loss of his friends. hell I mean I guess I, I see why he's still mourning his friends I understand one does not just simply stop mourning their friends after like a week because it, it's fucked up you know the way his friends died and I can see why he would hope that an imperial arm could resurrect him but I mean it makes it makes him more of a light, relatable character now that he still cares about his friends they look like he was a like didn't care about his friends at all in the second episode. He just looked past it. Oh, he's getting that hug. That's adorable. That's pretty adorable. Oh, sad and happy at the same exact time. Oh my god, dude. That is so awesome. Like, I just like, you know, the music that's playing right now. Hmm. Oh, I'm guessing this is the Ice Tegu. Oh my god, look at that. Look at those people chopping that. Holy fuck. Look at... Oh, dude, that's disgusting. Look at the fucking boot. That reminds me of what happened in JoJo. Who the hell... Estes, or Estif? Oh, damn, dude. He's... Oh my god, his face is probably ruined now. Dude, that face. Oh my. Well, at least it's a girl. We'll get some form of fan service, I guess, with her. Not that I want to see that. <laughs> He's still ripping people off? Oh my god. Leone's still ripping people off.
Dude, is he really gonna eat that? Oh, I was gonna say, I thought he was gonna deep throat that meat for a second. I was about to say, that's fucked up. Reusing still frames, it seems. They're reusing still frames. Wow. Dude, that is disgusting, man. He's like, just eating fucking meat and all that, slobbering on himself. Oh my god. Is this? Okay, I think that's her name. Holy shit, she killed over 400,000 northerners? Dude, I like that. He's like, iron fist mode. I like that still frame. You know, people may complain about the still frames, but you have to admit, the artwork on them looks really cool. I like the artwork. Leone just left you. Who is that? Justice right up. This is cute, Justice. Am I hearing boinging sounds? Say, dude. Well. That's a cute fucking dog. That's cute. I want one. Give it to me. That's an imperial arm? So an animal can be a tegu? Or is it... Well, it, I guess it definitely walked there if it's on a leash. Huh. That's so cute, man. That's a cute little dog, man. That is so cute. Whoa. That little dog did that. I think I know why she got her name Cute Justice now. It's because a cute dog. Oh my god. <laughs> That's so cute, man! That's so cute! Well, supposedly from what we heard, is that dog only reacts to evil people. Oh my god, she's dragging a fucking dog! What the fuck? What the fuck? No! Oh, that's awful! My god. How does that freaking Tegu like you? You're dragging him! Now, I'm curious, is this girl right here, I'm guessing Cute Justice, what I'm going to call her, is she evil, like Zank, the, uh, execute, like Zank, or any of the other people we have seen? I mean, or does she really have a sense for justice? Maybe she's, like, going to be the antagonist, but at the exact same time, she's going to have her sense of duty. Kind of like, you know, Smoker from One Piece or something. Or, uh, Kobe or whatever. She's still dragging that dog. What the fuck? Stop it! That's so messed up. That, that's animal abuse. That is animal abuse. Oh. Oh, is that it? That's it? What the hell? I was... No, no, no. I'll skip through the ending song right now. No way. 
Any more? Oh, uh, no. Yeah, that's it. What the fuck? That was too easy. Like, I mean, it didn't even feel like a 20 minute episode. Comment loading status so will click here to continue loading your comments. Okay, let me load the comments real quick. Let me see what y'all are saying. Okay. Wait a minute. Should I read the manga first to see what the fuck? Koro is adorable. Yandere. <laughs> I just started watching two series and they're both high versa. Maji Moji, Tokyo Ghoul. Drag the dog. <laughs> it's a warped sense of justice, Chibi. She is. She uses justice to justify her evil. Evil is in the eye of the beholder. She has a sense for justice, but it is clouded. No spoilers. Thank you, Ledon. Let's see. Last so hard, but she dragged Hordo. I'm not mean. Voice cracked. <laughs> oh, you seemed actually nice there. Stop like. Stop liking the dog, man. Why? Why can't I like little Koro? That's he's adorable. Let's see. What is he watching right now? Watching the coming got killed. Well, I was. Let's see, what else came out yesterday? I don't remember. Kamigai Kill, Baby Steps, Haikyuu, Gekon Shoujo, Sabu Geku, I think, or whatever the name of that series is, The Gun Fight Survival Club. And anything else come out yesterday? Did anything? I, I really don't know. Let me look at it. Give me a second. I gotta check my stats. So I don't know what came out today, so I'm gonna try to catch up to them. Okay, so... Oh, yes! Space Dandy! Oh, fuck yes. Yes, yes, yes. You gotta be with that dandy. Wait. Dandy. I love that dandy. So, let me find that. That will be so freaking awesome to watch. Especially getting to see the comedy that dandy does. Uh, there it is. Okay. Delete this Akami Got Kill. I'd like to delete that. Now, Space Dandy. This is gonna be go so good, so good, so good, so good. Okay, and now let me get that. Okay, return to those comments. Drag the dog. Justice will be swift. She's crazy than Reina. Gekon. Have you seen Sao? Yeah, I actually did a a 13 minute review on that on Saturday. So yeah, I I watched it. I can't believe what happened. I guess I'll follow you on your third channel. Thank you for not quitting. Hello, I'm Gekon. What the fuck? One dislike. Let's see. Sabagaku is so awesome. Arahara Rod. Crap, I'm an episode behind. Wait, is Arahara Rod already back? No, it's not. Oh, Himigoto's out. I might watch that. Oh, God. Okay, so my download of Space Danny will be done in about four minutes. Now, I'm sorry if the quality of the live reaction goes down because connections go into. Yeah, get the episode, so. My bandwidth's kind of going to be lacking a little bit in a second. So, I'm sorry if it uh, affects anyone. But, um, anyways. Let's see. I want to see. We're going to go back to these backlog of comments. See if I missed anything anyone said. I'm so behind in space, Dandy. The manliness of the Dandy. I need to go watch Berserk, Volume 15. Keep up the good work and uh, stay strong, TV. Thank you, Dan. Thank you, Dan. Honestly, the support you've given me and everybody else is currently commenting truly means a lot to me. I want you all to know that, as I've said a lot, even at the beginning of this video. I, if it wasn't for all of you, I would have broke, so just remember that. That's how much support you've all given me, and that's why I'm able to continue on focusing on this channel, and even do these live reactions at the moment. Uh, two minutes until it's done. So, hey man, what's up? Oh, hey Chris, how you doing? Himigoto! Himigoto will be after Space Danny. Koro is love. Koro is life. Wave if you see this, Chibi. I see it. The manliness. Okay. I love you. Scroll all the way up. I missed a lot of comments. Oh my God, there's so many. Contact me at Facebook, Gone Freaks, if you want to uh, help. If you want to help me flagging his shit. Who? Gone Freaks. Wait. Contact me at Facebook, Gone Freaks, if you want to help me flagging his shit. You talking about me? Hope not. What is, what the hell did I do to you? Honestly. And judging by your name, it's a Hunter Hunter name, so why? I, I Why? Well, I might be wrong. I might be misinterpreting your comments, and I could be wrong. It could be completely different. You might have meant to say that you wanted to help me out. I don't know, but I'm not going to say that. 
Just hopefully that's how it is. Okay, um... So you're gonna stream while watching anime, so what's your rating for... Okay, actually, I guess I should review the Kami Guy kill episode as I wait for this. Um... Personally, the episode, it was good. A lot of setup. There was a lot of setup in the recent episode, episode 5 of Kami Got Kill. You get to see Isdef, I think I got her name right. And you get to find out that the strongest Tegu is like this ice that Isdef has. You find out this girl, Cute Justice, might have a really good form of justice. And you see that our main male character taught to me you know, still mourning over his friends. So there was some character development. It shows more of the personality of Tatsumi. It shows that he doesn't just get over his friend's death in, like, one episode. He actually still cares. Now, the most for the most part, the episode was good. It was solid. It didn't seem rushed a little bit until that entire part where I saw the Tegu pop up. I thought for a fact, you know, Tatsumi was going to use it. So it correct on that part, so it wasn't technically rushed. But the animation, the animation seemed a little bit lazy in this re recent episode. Because, I mean... There's a lot of still frames. Usually I'm not one to complain. I'd rather have, you know, the entertainment value and the plot progression and stuff like that when I watch an anime. I finally I can deal with animation. I watched Ping Pong, even though the art style's whoa. The art style just definitely turned anyone off from watching it. Um I guess you could look past it, but I can see how people can complain about these still frames. That they definitely were a problem in the latest episode, but when they didn't have them, it looked really good. So I will say that. So let me see. If this is done. Yes, it's done. Space Dandy is done. Okay, I'm about to start it, everybody. Space Dandy, Season 2, Episode 5. Okay, give me just a second, everybody. Got to start it up. Again. Find it in here. Oh, this is going to be so good. I love my Space Dandy. Space Dandy is so good. That comedy they give. Okay. Oh yeah, I'm gonna start over the thing. I'm about to start Space Dandy in three, two, one, start. Okay. Watching the English dub, by the way. I'm not watching, you know, the sub. I like the dub. It does pretty cool. Okay, so we got fishing going on. Damn that fish. <laughs> Yay! Dandy and fa uh, bass fishing. <laughs> wonder what this episode's really going to focus on dude that art style what the hell is with the animation I noticed in the past three episodes the animation a little bit of daddy has been kind of lacking or weird I mean, that face, man. Yeah, music! Ugh. I don't know if they have a new opening song, though, for season two. This is just the English dub, so they have the old one. But I, did, I still love this. Ah, oh, I love that fucking opening. It's so good. It is so good. Man, I love my dandy. So, let me check comments as this opening goes. Uh, was that Darth Vader guy at the end of Death Gun? Or someone else? Yes, that was Darth, uh... Star Fader. Kirito, I am your father. I don't mind the still frames. They look good at least. I love the opening song. I'm going for 24 minutes because I'm an episode behind. I love the backstory. Let's see. Chibi, we have your back. I think they're saving budget for the next episode. Because I fought Tatsumi be training. Let's see. They're saving money for big fights. Chibi is starting a live reaction reviews. What advice would you concern spoilers? What advice would you give concerning spoilers when filming these? Wait, are you saying, like, concerning spoilers? You mean, like, talking in your reviews? Dude, it's a review. Personally, if you're going to go watch a review of something, you should expect some spoilers. I'm just going to be honest. I mean, of course there is reviews that don't have spoilers, but everybody has their own style the way they review. Everybody does. I mean, so many different viewers of, you, of anime do. And so, it just depends on what you want to talk about. If you want to, you know, talk about the certain specific scenes as reviewing it, or do you want to review it as, you know, an entire series to recommend. It just depends on your preference. Okay, so I'm starting. Let me get back to it. 
That narrator, I missed you, man. I missed that narrator. What the fuck is going on? Sir, the shit ain't eating my plant. The big fish is huge, baby. Oh, yeah. Dude, he's sinking in this. What the fuck is that? Tar? Dude, dude. Oh, that. Oh, so they are. They're on a planet of tar, it looks like. Or gunk, mud. What the hell is that? Dude, there is something wrong with the art style or animation, man, for the past three episodes. Look at that! Look at that! Oh my god, his face is like derpy looking. I love Danny, but my god, what is with that animation recently? I wouldn't trust a regular inhabitant of that planet. What I have last episode with that fish. Looks like we're having a western dandy this time around. <laughs> Are they walking sideways on that? What the hell? Yeah, is it, does anyone else not see this animation or art? I don't know if it's intentional or not, but that, that dude. When you watch an episode of like a comic I kill and then you go into this, it's like, what the hell? But I mean, like I said, this is Danny. It could be intentional. Dude. That underwear. <laughs> Oh, so this is going to be like one of those standard, like, folk tells, like, I caught the grandest fish in the sea, but I lost it at the last second. That's exactly what's probably going to happen this episode. I'm calling it. I don't know if it's just me, though. That girl, that that little girl reminds me of an anime movie. I forget what movie. Ponyo? No, 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 it's not Ponyo. What does that girl remind me of? She reminds me of someone from a movie. The hairstyle and everything reminds me of it. I think that's a reference. I wonder how big this fish is. Is it small? Massive? Oh, that would, oh, that would suck. Just fishing out in the middle of water. No land. Oh, my God. What about, you know, technology? Like, you know, internet. What would you do? Ew, that's not water. Oh my god, really diving in that? That's disgusting. Dude, Danny, stop it with the fucking underwear, man. Ooh, that is, ooh, that is, oof. No, please stop. Please stop. And what the hell is that? That's a mutated octopus. Oh. What the hell? That's a mutated looking squid though. That's like eight eyes. Yeah, seriously, that that house also reminds me of something. The father's like, you will not steal my child. I will kill you. Do not try to have any fine sense with him. Dude, Dandy, the way you're sitting, man, is just asking for, you know, butt sex. Sorry to offend anyone, but yeah, that's... That's the way Dandy is. I 
like the the style though, the way the art looks though, the contrast of it. Even though Danny looks derpy as hell, I do like the way the art looks. Hmm. Now there's a lot of still frames. This is very lazy. Very, very lazy. Like, I mean, these still frames look very lazy. Yeah, see this? Yeah, how many seconds have we had? We, I know we had at least already have like 20 seconds of still frames. Dude, there's been about 30 seconds of still frames. Oh my. Oh, great. Danny, you're going to make him a lot of bait. Oh, dude. You're going to stab him. Oh, never mind. Looks like a chocolate whirlpool or something. I don't like your maggots. Stay out of my way. That, that reminds me of um, Lord of the Rings. Remember that? Maggots. Right, so this Munagi is a legend. So I'm guessing no one's technically seen this creature, or they have a long time ago. I wonder how big it is. I, I, I really wonder how big this thing is. Watch it be something very generic or something. I don't know. Or a mindfuck. Dude, that food's making me hungry. I haven't ate today. Oh, man. That food's making me really hungry looking at that. Oh man, I'd love a mug like that for coffee too. Look at that massive ass mug, like this freaking big. Like, oh, that'd be so great. All I have is this little fucking coffee cup right now. I need like a massive mug. I'm just gonna drag you in. Please drag him in. Please, please drag him in. Oh my god, that little fish. Why the plan doesn't have him in? So we have these standard uh, people, you know, just looking down on Danny, saying like, "Oh, you're not gonna be able to do it. It's a legend. It's a story." I've seen this a lot before. Very standard uh, setup with this uh, episode. Is that mermaid? Oh my god, it is a mermaid. Is that the Minagi? Or is it just a mermaid? Because I can see why they said supposedly this Minagi doesn't fall for. Oh, what the fuck is that? Dude, look at the oh my! Daddy, swim, boy, swim, swim! Wow, he he's he's boned. He he's done. Oh, he was just having a nightmare. Oh, that was all a dream. What the hell? Well, I was trolled.
I doubt it reminds me of something that that little girl does. I don't know. Something's telling me it reminds me of Ponyo or something. Randy would definitely tell a lie. Oh, I like the music. Why does this remind this episode reminds me so much of something? I can't pinpoint it. Dandy's now swimming in a fucking barrel with a stick. I, I don't remember what that is from. I, I can't put my finger on it. I really can't. I've seen it somewhere. Like, I've seen the entire concept of it before somewhere. Wait. What the hell is that blue thing? Oh, I guess the blue sun. I mean, the blue moon. What the hell am I thinking, sun? Dude, stare into it. Infinite Sukuyomi will take you over. Don't worry, Infinite Sukuyomi will turn you into a white plant. It will devour you. <laughs> dude, those ways, man, are trippy. Oh, look at that! Look at me out! That dude, that face, man, that, the animation, oh my god. Seriously, there is no way it is intentional. It's been like this for the three episodes now. I hope they're not under budget, because I love Space Dandy. I do. Because it's clearly starting to show. I just hope they're saving their budget for something really good. What? Does that water have a mouth? I'm guessing it's massive. Dude, there is no fucking way. That dude, old man, is pulling up whatever is causing these waves. Do you... Oh my... That's a big ass... Dude, that thing, is, that thing can eat my house. That is how big that fish is. Gonna arrow that big ass. Holy shit, that old man. There is no way a few little arrows is gonna hurt that big ass. That fish is like probably five of my houses combined, or even longer. There is no way like six little wooden arrows are gonna hurt that thing. Oh my god. These are all muddy. It's ugly. Danny, you're not gonna catch that thing. There is no way in hell. You need a harpoon, you need like an anchor on top of like the mainland, and you need to crank it. And I mean, even then, I highly doubt something that size would be able to be reeled in. It'll bend the fucking metal. But, I mean, this is Danny. So what, what, why am I trying to bring in logic? Love that music though. Gotta turn it up for that. Dude, he's eating a fish. He's like, ah! He's crying. He's crying. Yeah, if one person can't do it, use three people. A little girl and two men. Well, an old man and nanny. There is no way. You are not pulling that in. Yeah, it better not budge. 
putting realism in this, I mean, I think it should have sunk your boat. There's no way QT and Meow is going to help either. That's fine, people. No. Whoa, all those people. Are you kidding me? Like, the entire planet's inhabitants are helping out to pull this fish in? I don't know. There's a good... About 30 to 40 people probably there. I don't know if they... No, there's no way they can pull something... That... No, that thing is too mad. Look at that shit. Nah, nah. Music's good. Very good. I love music. Music's good. But there is no way they're pulling that thing in. <laughs> My dandy's gonna shoot a bow. This is a dude that can't fire his gun, right? You're giving him a bow? No! This dude can't fire his own laser gun! And somehow he magically hits target, still. There is no way. What is that thing? That... Oh, it's around his foot. Oh, that's gonna suck. Dude, there's a bunch of them, not just one. What the hell? Oh, yeah, this just went out of this world. It's going to, the, like, the blue moon. Why your dandies on there, though? What the hell is going to happen to Dandy? Dandy got drug up onto that comment. <laughs> Dandy's dead, isn't he? <laughs> no way. How the hell did he get out of that? He's a Cinderle. That old man's a Cinderle. <laughs> wow. Episode, I'm guessing it's almost done. It's very... generic. I mean, it's not bad. It's enjoyable. I had fun watching it. But well, it's very generic. It doesn't have that dandy mod, though, like last episode. Oh my god, last episode, man, that high school. It's about to be over, I think. They're going to f go for another fish now. To be continued. That's two episodes in a row, Danny hasn't died. Whoa, that preview. That preview. Dude. Honey. Dude, honey, man. She's out like a show. Okay, so, anyways. Give me some recommendations what you think I should watch, everybody. Everybody, give me some recommendations. I'll, I'll wait for comments. I should do that. I'm going to go scroll through the comments and see what y'all are saying. Code Geass. Oh yes, I have Code Geass. Yeah, I have Code Geass. Everybody, everybody, if you can hear me right now, yes, I do have Code Geass. So you can either choose for me to watch Himigoto, 
or Gekon Shoujo, or you could tell me to watch the first episode of Kogias. Okay, so uh, I'll wait for to see some replies because I think you guys are kind of a little bit like 30 seconds behind the actual events of the live stream. So, anyways, let me go through these comments, what you all have said. 163 likes. Oh, oh my god, 201 likes! I'm amazed how many people are really liking this. I, I honestly thought, you know, everybody would have hated this idea of live streaming. Holy god. Oh. That's amazing. Thank you. Chibi, chibi, chibi. Did you see the new episode of Kame? Yeah, I just saw it. Who the fuck gave this a dislike? Everybody has their own opinion, everybody. For instance, if, you know, they dislike it, they have their own rights to dislike a video. Honestly. I, I want to be honest. I see nothing wrong with it. That is, you know, doing the proper way to express your opinion with a dislike. But to, yeah, you know what I'm talking about. But, I mean, I'd rather have a dislike. Hands down. Hands down. So, I can deal with dislikes, and don't worry, anyone. Honestly, anyone's allowed to express their opinion. Uh, I don't see any new comments yet. I for season three, Haikyuu. Okay, someone said Haikyuu. Gekon, Kogios, Kogios. For some reason, I can't watch the live stream. Wait, wait, what? Kogios, Kogios. Oh god, oh god. I opened Pandora's box. Kogios, Kogios. Oh god. Okay. Okay, I think you've all spoken. I've seen Code Geass and Gekon Shoujo, so I'll watch Gekon Shoujo after Code Geass. I'll watch one episode. Okay, so episode one, I have been told by countless people to watch this, so hopefully it's good. Like, very good, because I've heard a lot of good things about it. So, let me get it started. Actually, I'll just read the comments real quick. I just want to see what y'all are saying to make sure I get adjustable, you know, size. Yeah, I'm seeing nothing but Code Geass spam going on right now. Oh my, that is a lot. Gintama? I don't have Gintama. Curious, Chibi, have you watched Anohana? Yes, I have watched it. Chibi Equal Diplomacy, Himigoto, Death Note. I've already watched Death Note. Sailor Moon Crystal, I've said three. I already did a review on that, but yeah. Watch Steins Gate or Code Geass. I've already seen Steins Gate, so I guess Code Geass it is. Kogios, Kogios, oh my god, there, it is flooded with Kogios. It literally is flooded with Kogios right now. I'm looking at all this, oh my god. Okay, so I pre it's pretty much obvious that you all want me to start, you know, Himigoto. Nah, I'm just joking. Nah, I'm fucking with you. I'm fucking with all of you. Okay, I'm going to start it now. So I'm going to be starting the first episode of Kogios in... Wait, nah, I just might as well bring up the video and then count down and pause it. Okay. Anyways, I'll be starting Code Geass in three, two, one. Startle. Okay. This better be good. I swear to you. Wait, Code Geass, Lee Ouch of the Rebellion? Whoa, 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 whoa. Is this, is this the right one? Wait a minute. I, I want to pause it here. I, I know there's a season two to this, so I want to pause it. Is Code Geass. Leouch, Leouch, whatever the fuck you say his name, of the Rebellion, is that season one? Because it says right here, the first screen pops up. It's pink writing, it says Kogios, Leouch, Rebellion. Is this right? I I'm just making sure, because I don't want to watch the wrong one. I don't want to start on season two. That'd be like, what the fuck am I doing? So let me know real quick, everybody. I, I don't want to watch the wrong one. Let's see. R&R. &R. Okay, everybody's telling me to command me to watch the show. I'm waiting for I'm waiting for to see your guys' response. Oh my god, Kogios, Liam Reese said it's coming. Chief, if you didn't watch Kogios yet, what have you done with it? have you not done with your life? <laughs> done. Okay, so um two seasons. Wait, it does it not have two seasons? Oh, okay, so it is the first one. Okay, okay. I'm making sure. Okay. Never mind. I'm gonna start it now then. Give me just a second. I'll get back to it. Okay. I'm at eight seconds. Well, we got the Higurashi cicadas going on. I heard this is a mech, so... We'll have to see. I'm, I'm usually not fond of mechs, so I'm gonna be honest. But we'll see. Art style looks really good. I'll be honest there.
for Tanya. I have to say, the animation looks really nice. How old is this? Is this old as Death Note? Because this clearly looks good. Dude, the planet looks like shit. Dude. Holy god, Japan's trashed. That's Nestle Ouch. Stage one, the day the demon was born. Two to music. Oh, uh, oh my God, dude! Dude, that music. Oh God, that is good. Oh, I'm a sucker for music. That is good. That is good. Or fly to floor two, code three. Oh, uh, we got our prick nobles right there. Dude, their legs are really long. What the hell is with they? The legs. Oh, uh, Leluch? That's how you say his name? Leluch. Dude, he's declaring his uh, victory in under nine minutes. Nah, he's not on that L level, though. Now, I wonder why you all are so inclined to tell me to watch this. That's one thing. It looks good. Just what? I'm waiting for that one moment that it'll just be like, what the hell? That fucking music! Oh my god! That music is really good! So, I'm guessing this is like a communist society. Dude, that music is really good, though. So they're calling 11s uh, J Japanese, or Japanese are 11s? Well, so the regular Japanese are terrorists? That's some serious foreshadowing right there. Worrying or crying about will not bring the dead back.
So terrorism is going on in this. This is really cool. I like the concept because you don't get to see a lot of terrorist anime. Nightmares. So which thought is good or not? I'm, I'm going to just take a guess and say that whoever this general dude is, this uh, big dude, this aristocrat, I'm guessing he's a bad guy. Oh my god, that driving is horrible. That is why you never try to speed on the interstate, or anywhere. You're getting wrecked. Yeah, they, they had to be drunk to make a wreck like that. Those legs are extremely long, though, on the main character. Look at that! Look at his legs, man! Oh my god! Look at that, man! He should be called Leggy! His legs are... I don't even know how to... God, his legs are like... That! the hell? What happened? What was that? Oh damn. That, that music, man, though. Already three different soundtracks, and I love it. That's a bomb, ain't it? That's a bomb. That is a fucking bomb. What kind of bomb is that? It's not a hydrogen bomb? Is that a nuclear bomb? Like a, a nuke? I mean, what is that? Or is it just a regular explosive? Heading towards the ghetto? That's not right. That's not nice at all to say. Probably sub bear. Dude, that is awesome. So apparently there's either racism, prejudice, or something like there's something going on against, you know, the original Japanese, I'm guessing. They're being called 11s. Well, why? Is it because the area is called Area 11? Or is it something else? Dude, the main character, oh my god. He's able to tell that he's probably in a subway on the way the ground is moving. Oh my god. Uh -huh. What the hell is that?
So the terrorists have stolen something very important. I'm guessing it's that bomb or whatever it is. A chemical weapon. Oh god, poison gas bomb. Oh shit, that's not good. Not as devastating as a hydrogen bomb, but that's still pretty bad. I wonder how far the effect is. I mean, the bomb is fucking massive. Want to take over the entire country, city, a building? And why they steal it? That's the big question. Okay, so there is prejudice against the original Japanese, I'm guessing. And Britannia took them over. Okay. Oh, that bomb is about to go off. That bomb is about to go off. Didn't it just get electric shock or charge I just saw on it? Dude, that bomb is about to go off. I saw an electric coming out of it, or like, smart. What? Suzaka is. Mm. Oh, Dan. That friend's dead. That friend is dead. Yep. Yep. He's gonna die by this poison. And that's gonna cause. Is that a girl coming out of it? What? Is that an artificial human? A prisoner? What is that? Hmm, I wonder if that's a uh, artificial human, like, you know just a man-made human or is that a person that's been experimented on wait what that is for poison Oh wow, he's being asked to kill his own friend. He's gonna get killed. He's gonna get killed. Yep. Hey, what are you shooting with? It wasn't a bullet. Dude, they're all brainwashed. Wow. He killed his own self. And that's why it's being called poison, because if that does get leaked out, it'll poison the entire image of you. Ah. Okay.
I have music, man! Dude! Have some good ass music! They're killing random people! What the fuck?! They're just killing ra uh, random civilians! And no! They're killing off the civilians over the actions of one terrorist? Dude, the main character's about to break. This is really good. Oh my god. We're just shooting random ass people. They just shot a little fucking kid. Dude, they just killed a little kid. They had shown up, but I mean, it was clearly a little kid they just killed. Did she just die? No, 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 no. There's no way she died. She has some importance for them to want her. Is she really dead? This is fucked up, man! No wonder this main character breaks, probably. Oh my god. I heard that he's like L. I mean, not L, but uh, Kira, but. Wow. So she's not dead. She's Cuba, be careful. She wants a contract. She's Cuba. You'll live as a human, but you'll be different from other humans. What the hell? So it'll be different from other humans, but you'll still be human. What, intelligence? Is he getting a mech? What is it? Powers? Ah. Uh. What happened to his ah? Uh? His last name's Britannia now. He can control people? Dude, he can control people? Dude, he can control people. I didn't think that would be in this show. I thought it was just going to be Max. So he can tell people to kill their fucking selves. He attained power. On that face. Dude. That's the end of that episode. Oh! Oh, God.
God, dude, that is, I, I, that episode. Oh man, it's not the. I want to be honest here. It's not the best thing I've ever seen, but shit, and no wonder that you guys like that. He he fucking just made people commit suicide. He's like, oh, that is good. That's some good shit right there. That that is some good shit. Oh. He just fucking get, he, he he pulled Akira. He he said just you know since I am Leoch Britannia, kill yourselves. You know just in name, just like oh my god, dude. I I didn't think it was about that. I didn't think it would have like I guess he, I don't know. Is that supernatural or is that just you know an experiment with genes, genetic coding, or I don't know what it is. But whatever it is, that was wow. There is no ending song, everybody. I'm just like, no, the episode ended. It had no ending song on the first episode. But that's... Wow. It's definitely a good setup episode for things to come. That was good. That was really good. I, I definitely was mind-fucked when it came to the entire power pod. I didn't expect him to be able to do that. So now I see. He's going to make uh, his faction, I'm guessing a terrorist faction that's also called Britannia. Maybe he might want to become the true Britannia, or he might try to help out the Elevens, I'm guessing, but... Hmm. Interesting, interesting things definitely happened with th this episode, because, I mean, at first it was it was good, but the music gets you, the music drags you in. The animation definitely saw it. For, I'm going to take a shot and say this is maybe a 2008-2006 anime, for the animation, it looks really good. It definitely does. And the music, my god, that, that's definitely the best part so far. But that, that mindfuck man, at the end, that got me. Okay, so I'm going to start episode two in just a second. I am going to look at the comments real quick. I just had to relay my thoughts right there. That's some good shit, man. Oh, man. Okay, there we go. That is good. What's he watching, just I'm watching Code Geass episode two in just a moment. Episode two, episode two, episode two. Code Geass. There's an ending song. You didn't. Have, you don't have it. And so it's so mind fucking what I miss finally. Okay. Sup, Chibi. Sup, everybody. I, I don't know. I haven't been watching constant. I've watched episodes. So anyone that said anything, thank you so much for po commenting and posting. It means a lot. I do read them. I am scrolling through them and looking at them after each thing. Lol reaction. Chibi, watch at least two episodes. Lol, Cube. The power of kings cannot kill gods. Wait for it, Chibi. It shows on this episode. Superpowers. The power of the king. There is a serious lagging here. Nothing wrong with classics. Wait, it's lagging? I don't think it's lagging, is it? it let me know if it's lagging. But um, Old but classic reactions are hilarious. His face and the king, got, uh, the kid got shot. That shit is old. Just look at the comments. Chibi, what anime are you watching? What's Code Geass about? My first neck. It'll be real quick anyway. I just gotta do a review on Blade Dance. Both Pest Laws, Death Note is my favorite anime ever, and I've heard CGI's on that level. I need to watch it. Uh, Naked Hello, yes, Naked Hello. Code has many great... Code has many great pieces. I'm guessing uh, Code Geass. Let's see. Code Geass greater than Death Note. Oh my god. She's a guy who flagged Chibi. We're not giving up on Chibi no matter what. No matter how many channels you flag. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Arden. That, that's, that means a lot, man. Thank you. And everybody else, too. Um, what's he watching? Kogias. Oh my god. Hate mech anime. Don't know why. I do too, honestly. Please, wait. Just saw Hunter Hunter comment. Please review, oh, fuck, there's so many comments. Please review Hunter Hunter episode 101, 141 on this channel. Yeah, I will. Don't worry, don't worry. Just today, I'm just taking a break, doing a live reaction, chilling to some episodes. That's what I'm doing. Okay. Kogias Masterpiece. TV watch the ending song if you missed. Uh, fine. I I'll watch the end the ending song most likely will play this upcoming episode. I'm going to do the next episode. Here, here it is, actually. Do you want me to watch Code Geass episode 2? Or do you want me to watch the recent anime that aired yesterday and today? Let me know. I I'll wait for your guys' comments and feedbacks on that. Okay, I I'll wait for that, so I'm going to continue scrolling up. Chi, please review Mummyo Kun Soul to more Rail Wars. <sighs> Rail Wars. Rail Wars. You're really going to make me want to... Uh, no. Let's see. Let's see. Okay. Reading different things right now. 
No. Yeah, never mind. Going back to the video. Anyways, Chibi, stay on for ten more hours. Will this go up as a video? Yeah, it'll definitely go up as a video. It'll upload completely once the live stream is done. It does that for any live stream. So yeah, I'll definitely add it, so don't worry. Hey, Chibi, yo guys, sorry for uh, ebbing out for too long. Let's see, I'm going to watch the next episode the same time as you. Okay, catch IP. Hey, Chibi, I'm going to start a new show today. I'm going to... You're going to start a new show today? You're going to let me pick it? Uh, Peter, uh, can we go to our last stage? I'd like to see that shit. That'd be good. That'd be really freaking good. <laughs> Everybody would love that. I want to be honest. They would love to see that. Um, okay, I'm about to start, everybody. Let me get my my juice here. I'm pretty thirsty. Give me a second. Ah, that tastes good. It's really good. So, yes, Code Geass, episode 2, episode 2. Code Geass. Haikyuu is hype. It's one of the best manga ever. Okay, I've seen a lot of episode two. Okay, fine. I'll start episode two, and I gotta get to the other anime to watch here, buddy. Okay? But you know that. It depends, though, on the hype it gives me. We'll, we'll see. Okay, Kogios. Episode two. Okay, I'm starting this video in three, two, one. Startle. Okay, let's see. I'm guessing this is previous. 2010. This episode 2, right? Yeah, this episode 2. Thank you for Tani's newest weapon, the Nightmare Frame. Ugh. It's all previous, man. I want to skip it, but if anyone else is watching this, I don't, I'm not going to skip it. I don't want to, you know, mess up the order if anyone else is watching this video along with me. No, I do like the series, though. Is you gonna show me an opening yet? I'd like to see the opening. The Awakening of the White Knight. No, I guess I don't get no opening yet. Strange power. You seemed really happy to have that power when you were smiling last episode. Hmm, I don't think that power is going to work on a mech. There's no fucking way that can work on a mech. Wait, can he... Can it work on someone that he can't see? That'd be weird. Huh? Dude, his personality seems a little bit different. Is he really controlling her? Oh, he can't control her. Okay, so it needs direct eye contact. So it kind of is like the death note a little bit. Oh, he's about to kill her! He's about to kill her! He's going to look at her eyes! Oh, God, dude. She's dead. Dude! He just took her <laughs> He just trolled her. Like, give me your nightmare. How far does this power go? Can it go to anyone? Is it only on Britannia type people? I, I, that, I, I don't know. But he needs direct eye contact. There has to be more restrictions to this. He didn't kill her either. That's really weird. Did he? Huh. Wow, so the friend got saved. That's... Kind of reminds me of uh, Kami Got Kill. He got saved by a little object. Like on his chest, probably, or somewhere on his back. He's gonna get a nightmare for him? It's 
So it's a unique mech, as always. No offense to anyone, but, I mean, it's always a unique mech that nobody else has. Yeah, the music is so tough in this. There's a big fucking war going on. I mean, these aristocrats are just having fun. Shows you the corrupt... Dude, that fan service. Dude, look at that fan service. Not as high quality, though, but I mean, that fan service. What was I talking about a second ago? Oh, yeah. Aristocrats, you know, just having fun while people are at war. Typical. Dude, I'm guessing he can technically be a part of uh, Britannia at the moment since he has one of their mechs. So, I guess he doesn't seem like an enemy. Dude, they killed children. That's messed up, man. Uh, that's sad. That's really sad. Killing off the children, man. They, they, they're not even sparing children. They're just killing them off and killing off everybody. He's looking at this entire war field. Uh, like, this, this field right now is a chessboard. Whoa. That's pretty smart. Ah, oh, so he's helping her out. Okay. So now he's about to fall into a terrorist as a terrorist and probably become the entire country's enemy. The big thing is, I wonder why they call this series Code Geass. Probably going to be some form of mech called that. Or his power is called that. Dude, this is really good. This is really good anime. I still don't have that in the entire bit of how there's so much hype behind it yet. I'm still trying to figure that out. But I'll probably see it soon. He's like hacking everything. Dude. Leo, sure, Leo, whatever his fucking name is. He's hacking everything, dude. Like he's giving weapons and stuff. Dude, there's gonna be massive riots going on in a second. So he also knows how to use tactics. I guess a man that can beat, you know, aristocrat in eight minutes of chess is good. So he is thinking of it like a chess game. Dude, I don't like that prick. I do not like that king. He's like, I'm a badass. I think I'm like Maryland status. He shouldn't be called prince or king or anything.
Dude, he even thought about, you know, the entire communication being monitored. Wow. He's a smart character. I need to get this damn soundtrack, man. That, ah, uh, that is good. They are getting wrecked. No, I scratch like <laughs> he's shaking. <laughs> Dude, I've heard this song before. I've actually heard this song before on YouTube, like somewhere. I was like for OST, like original soundtracks. <laughs> Konnichiwa! That, that professor, man. They are getting wrecked, dude! Britannia! You're getting destroyed by, like, a high school student. Hell yeah, justice! Five options. He, he even fought at five different options the enemy could do. God, he he really does think ahead. It's like L. That prince is full of itself. He really is. Dude, that that prince guy has nothing on the main character at all. Dude, he has nowhere near the level of intelligence. He's getting his shit wrecked. He's had you in checkmate since the beginning. Dude, that laugh! That is good, that is good. He's like, ah, oh. <laughs> dude, I can't even mimic that. That is good. Dude, this anime's pretty fucking good. I'm actually really liking this. Lancelot. Uh oh. That's not good. It seems like this professor, this scientist, or whoever he is, seems to be more, I guess, have more tactics than the prince, it seems. Like, he seems to be the main mastermind. I want to bet, you know, he'll become the main guy in the end. Probably the main, I guess, antagonist. Even though I'm guessing our main male character is the entire anti-hero. Whatever. Oh, his friend is going to probably get the Lancelot. Oh, okay. So Leoch's uh, friend is going to get the Lancelot, they're going to fight it out, and to probably make this entire situation fucked up, they're probably going to have him kill his own friend. Dude. He saved his friend last episode, and if he does kill his... Oh, no, 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 that doesn't happen, does... no! He saved his friend last episode, I mean, he's going to be the cause of actually killing him? Oh, no, that, that better not happen. Oh, no. That is going to happen. Oh, I, I know it. That's going to happen. Yeah, he is getting it, so yeah. Either he's going to rebel along with his best friend, or he's going to get killed. 
Or he could join Britannia's side. I guess he has three options, but I mean, it seems like the logical thing that's going to happen is he's going to die. That thing is... Wow. That's fast. But he's... Oh, yeah. He got shot. Blocked it. Oh, that's not good. Well, the like nipple things came out. He's always like, shit, <laughs> shit. It's like a blob bullet, too. Hmm. Good thing uh, the main character can't kill someone for the suit, because if he could, he probably would have killed his friend. Accidentally. Crap, I'm getting a call. Give me a sec, I gotta pause it. Crap. Wait a minute. Give me a sec, I gotta call him, Scott. I gotta... Sorry, buddy. Very sorry. Channel... Okay. Manage to. I, I gotta explain the details, so I'm sorry, everybody. I gotta explain this. Well, I can't. Fuck. Okay. Doing a live stream right now on the channel. There we go. Okay. Anyways, let me start now. Sorry about that. I'm on, uh, I'm 15 minutes and 25 seconds. Okay? That's exactly where I'm at. So I'm starting in 3, 2, 1, go. Channel is back. Whoa, whoa, whoa! My channel is back. What? Someone just sent me a message saying my channel is back. What? Is it really? No, no. I'm being trolled. 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 Thank you, anyone that helped. Oh my god. Oh shit, dude. It's, I, I didn't. Oh my god. I didn't think it'd be. I didn't. Oh my god. Oh, thank you so much, everybody. Honestly, thank you. Oh my god. Oh my god. I, I, oh, dude. Dude, my channel is fucking back, dude. I, I gotta stop the last year. You don't want to see my tears, man. Oh, my God. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, everybody. George, hey, forever, Code Provider, Sawyer, Rick, Dan, everybody, any cheat, everybody. I will repay that the 
the kindness, man. Thank you. I love you all, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I, I gotta get off here.